New South Wales. Now, as we move into tomorrow, that front is to to the northeast of New South Wales, but those thunderstorms will run right across the inland and up across the Northern Territory. And then that's into Western Australia. It's going to help draw hot air down into the southwestern corner, so temperatures rapidly on the rise for Perth. The high pressure system continues to reach further east, and the benefit of that is we'll finally start to see an influx of milder air moving into New South Wales, then pushing Queensland and as Wednesday, Thursday, so finally an end to this record heat wave across many parts of inland Queensland. There's rainfall, but still the storms from through the east of Queensland, also up across the Northern Territory, but it's around the Western Territory that we love to see better of the rainfall of So it's like and pattern.